Hey everyone, welcome to another unboxing here on DC Spin Master. Alright, as always, I'm your host, Frozen Stratos, and today, well, I got a box. This says Target on it. It also says Fragile for some reason. This thing isn't too fragile, but uh, this didn't actually come from Target. Uh, but what did come from Target was this. Uh, this is the Riddler. I finally got my hands on a Riddler, and I've, I've been holding it for a few days, but I felt like, oh, this wouldn't be uh, a good enough unboxing with just the one thing. So I got another thing, and we'll get into that later. But I did actually finally want to check this out. And I gotta say, still not a fan of uh, that. It's tough. Am I just weak? Yeah, I'm probably just weak. Um, I'm also just really not a fan of how there are multiple... You got multiple of these. All right. Um, oh, wow. It's tiny. I thought... Oh. He's got what looks to be either a computer or a, a briefcase. And then... A sonar thing? This might go really well with the, uh, you know, man bat Langstrom. Um, alright, let's get into the figure itself. Get to. Oh. Okay. Also, by the way, if you've been keeping up with the news, uh, Mr. Freeze has been spotted, and so has the brand new, uh, uh tech armor Batman stuff. Okay, we have. What seems to be the same, uh, you know, checklist stuff, which I'm not surprised by. All right, Riddler. I did want to compare him to the Joker. These are these are a lot. Yeah, these are more different than you'd think. I did kind of want to do a comparison with the regular Joker, but um, yeah, he even has like. Uh, little details on the back of his hand, so this arm might be a new mold, or, you know, at least different from this Joker. Like, this is... I don't want to say an extensive remold, but it is more of a remold than I thought it would be. I'm really not a fan of this dinky, uh, staff. Like, when I saw it in... In this image, I didn't think that would be the whole thing. I don't know why they didn't do the whole, you know, uh, separate it between all three of the, all three of the things, but here we go, I guess. All right, that's fine. Either way, uh, he's not all I got, uh, because uh, a few days ago, I've been, I've been tracking this thing down for weeks, um, and they're starting to get better prices on eBay. I, still not big on the price that I got for this one, uh, but this did come from eBay, uh, and I think I failed at, like, two auctions two days in a row, and it got pretty frustrating until, uh, I came across this one listing that was way cheaper and ended at 3.45 a.m. I woke up specifically, uh, to, to get that listing, and thankfully, well, I mean, it's here. I want it. This is mine now. <laughs> so, uh, let's take a look at this. Alright. I knew this box was a little too thick, but it's just a bunch of bubble wrap. This is, at long last, one of the hardest ones of the Batman line to find. It is the Thomas Wayne Batman, at long last. Last, I can't believe it. Uh, I have not seen these in a lot. These are starting to, to populate a lot. So I got this. I won it at uh, $15.50. And then tax made it come out to like 60 something. Oh, look at that. Um, did I say 60? I meant 16. And, um, you know, I thought these, these retail at about $8. So I kind of paid double. But, like, maybe I just pretend some of that shipping so it doesn't feel like you know i did get free shipping on it so basically i just paid 16 something for it which 
grand scheme is not too bad, especially for this. I haven't been able to find it uh, in store, and my friend who is really lucky at these has not been able to, to track one of these down for me either. So, God, finally, finally, oh man. And like, I, I will be honest, this is just the regular new 52 one with, or Rebirth one with just pouches painted on. I think yeah that's just paint uh, but let's oops, let's get into these lockers and see what we got whoa nice okay this toxic esque green shield I man this, a toxic greenish yellowish grapple hook grapple gun whatever you want to call it and then a batarang Heck yeah, okay. I kind of wanted uh, the red versions of all those weapons. Let's see if I can bring that one up. Yeah, the red one would have made a lot more sense for this guy. But uh, I don't know, I'm fine with it. Also, uh, if you've been keeping up with me on some of my other, other channels, specifically Soto Pop, uh, you'll know that I've been collecting Final Faction, uh, which is a Dollar Tree exclusive toy line sort of accident like it has certain collector ideals in mind it also has accessory packs to it and they have blasters and guns and pistols and stuff so i wonder you know since i don't necessarily have a uh what is it a um red hood to give these two you know what that's not a bad look. It's, I mean, it's really not. I I appreciate this. You could potentially cut the uh, cut the you know trigger out of the gun itself, but um, this gray gun uh, comes in the accessory pack. I think it's the assault accessory pack. Um, it also has a black gun, which I. Uh, a black gun which I could not find on my desk um, but uh, you know you just buy two of those it's two dollars and then he'll either have two gray guns and two black guns and whenever they eventually because I'm sure they will whenever they eventually get to the red hood you can give them two guns uh, so two black two gray it's a good time I, I'm I consider these pretty good weapons for them uh, they also have this really awesome grappling hook uh, in that same weapons pack, I believe, and not a bad look. It is this this part is separate, so I mean, as as an upgrade set, as uh, an incidental upgrade set for your Batman figures, go to Dollar Tree. This works out, and it, oh man. Like, it really pairs well with this guy. I'm I'm so happy to finally have both him and him, because this is this has been a bit of a chase. Um, yeah. Uh, outside of that, honestly, all I think I need uh, out of this line is... Uh, what is it? The two super rares? The two super rare uh, Batman and Joker figures. Uh from the most recent wave um and then i think i just need the glow in the dark shazam um i feel like there's at least one more oh and uh i think the gold armor batman but not not the uh the most recent armor but like the just armored batman i don't know if that makes any sense but I, I think I'm close to maybe getting everything. I, I, I'm almost there. Uh, but, you know, the line keeps going. We still have the new... Um, do I have an image of it? Yeah, we still have these new <laughs> these new mechs uh, to start getting. So, hey, the hunt is on. Anyways, thank you so much for watching. If you like this episode, hit the like button and subscribe if you want to hear more from us each week. And 50 of you, 51 of you actually already have... Uh, so thank you so much for showing so much support support for this um, this new channel. I I love this toy line a lot, and uh, I'm I'm happy uh, to share it with you. Uh, 
actually coming this week coming on wednesday i have a brand new top 10 video going up where i'm going to be speculating on what i think is going to be coming to this line uh it does get a bit rambly but it is a good time so i hope you guys enjoy it just like this episode uh so tell me in the comments down below what you thought what you're still looking for what you want from this line anything and everything thank you so much for watching keep it hell yeah